what happened to me is when I was growing up, I heard the Jesus stories, and I found Jesus absolutely compelling. I thought he was awesome. I loved that whenever there was an in-group and that had pushed somebody to the edges, he always went to the edges. If there was somebody who'd been kicked to the curb, he went to them. If there's somebody who no one would listen to, he would listen to them. Um, I love that whenever somebody had a very strict sense, set of rules about who's in and who's out, he always challenged those categories of in and outness. You know what I mean? So I believed. I I believe. I find him utterly compelling in the mysterious, resurrected Christ who appears time and time again to people. I, it's just fantastic. It, for me, it is the insistence that I'm loved, that there is a death and rebirth mystery hidden in the very fabric of creation. So you don't hear me use the word Christianity because I don't have... I didn't come in through some, which religion are you going to pick, door. You know what I mean? I came in through a very deep, heartfelt experience that resonated with what I knew about the world. And this path orients me, it grounds me, it fills me with more joy, it makes me more likely to do the right thing. You've just probably never heard me do something on Christianity because I don't even know what that means. You know what I mean? Like rules? Like a list of doctrines? What? I'm into what Jesus talked about was your very real fullness of experience of this world right here, right now. And that's what I find interesting. 